just so good to know we're good and if you guys did it, we're gonna buy the patrol bike. Like, so I'm gonna go ahead and say this. Like, subscribe, hit that notification bell. After you subscribe, so I can get so you can get notified when new videos come up. And so I can get notified when you subscribe and I'll get your YouTube username so I will know who you are and I'll give you a shout out on my next video also guys. Watch my next I'm gonna put a video. We got 25 subs. Uh watch that. That's a must watch video. I'm gonna have must watch in the title. So guys watch that. I'm gonna shout out the person I'm gonna give it and I have something big planned. So stay tuned for that. And in this video guys we really bought the patrol bike. It's it's a pretty cool car itself. Well it's a pretty cool bike. In that car. It's a bike. Um it's very nice. It's it's pretty fast actually without the engine. It's faster than the ray or the deja vu. I believe it's faster than those without the little engine upgrade. And we just have the engine upgrade, which makes it go pretty reasonably fast for its price, $45,000. I'd expect it to go so much fast, you know. It looks pretty pretty cool with the blue rims and the green, uh, green skin. It's pretty cool. It was available here until the service came out. So now the service came out, it was moved to the police base and the prison base. That's the only base where you can get it now at, so you have to go there. It's a pretty cool escape vehicle. It might be a bit faster than the Surge with, like, uh, acceleration. Of course, it's not faster with top speed, but it is pretty quick. You know, it can't make that jump, which means it, it's not uh, the best. Oh, it just made it up that. Okay, it's a pretty cool vehicle. It made it up that. <laughs> No vehicle could make it up that except for the monster truck, and I think the cyber truck might. But it's a cool, pretty cool vehicle, all in all. It's pretty quick. It's it stops pretty quick, but I had the max uh, level stopping thing, and it accelerates pretty quick compared to the Cirrus. And I think it might go the same speed as the Challenger. I'm not 100% sure. So we're gonna actually do a speed test. Um. I'm gonna get my timer set up and my stopwatch set up while I get to the thing. Okay. Mm hmm. Okay. The stopwatch is set up. So, I'm gonna do this. Three, two, one. It's looking pretty good. Okay, guys, so we did hit a pull at the end, but I'm gonna. Uh, when we hit the pull, it was at 16 seconds, so I'm just gonna count 16 seconds. The second we hit that pull, it was 16 seconds, so. I went. Bro, this is Lambo. Actually, it says Lambo with it as well. Let's just sell Lambo with it. I think Lambo might, uh, because the acceleration Lambo sucks, but the top seat is amazing, incredible. And it is a pretty expensive car to begin with. This is my first major purchase car. Uh, it was my last car purchased before I took the unfortunately long break from Jiro Break, the one and a half year break. I regret that. I just played Jiro Break since the first year came out, 2017. And yeah. So guys, speed test Lambo to the thing. Long medium range. Three, two, one. Like I said, the acceleration sucks, but top speed's pretty good. It's oh, I just hit the watch. I was counting along the way, and I'd say it was like at 14 seconds, 13 seconds. But you guys can set your own stopwatches if you want. But we know it's faster than the patrol bike. Actually, we can do that again, maybe? Should we do that again? We could do it again. I like how the lights, just how they look. They look very sporty. 
Let's do it again. So three, two, one. Fourteen seconds, so I was right. It is fourteen seconds. I'll just come here and let's take it all the way back because it's fast. This is fast. And then let's go ahead and go get the um the challenger right here. We have to come here and challenger fully upgraded, same as before. Three, two, one. Seventeen seconds. Seventeen sixteen seventeen seconds, so it's a lot the same speed as the patrol bike, but it's five thousand dollars more. I mean it's five yeah, it's five thousand dollars more than it. And then I'll try the the short range speed test. Let's see how it compares. This is basically all acceleration. Uh, top speed doesn't really matter in this one. It's all acceleration. So Rosa would be pretty much anything that has the best acceleration. And the Sharon would be anything in the reverse speed test because it's the fastest reverse vehicle in the game. So I'll try the Challenger short range speed test. Three, two, one. Eight seconds. That took it eight seconds to get there. Not too shabby. Not too shabby for a fifty thousand dollar car. We're gonna test out the roadster actually how it is uh later uh, at the end. We're gonna test out how the roadster is with it. Just to see, you know. And the how just to show you how quick the roadster is compared to the other ones. So tour bike, short range, three, two, one. Seven seconds, so that's one second faster. About I'm I'm rounding these, uh, so it's about seven seconds. Uh, so it's one second faster than the um than the other one. So let's go ahead and grab our trusty Lamborghini toy. Mm, of course, of course we do. Just grab the Lamborghini. And we can just spawn the roaster when we do that. Oh, please report. Oh, get off the screen. Thank you very much. Let's come right back here. Lamborghini short, short speed test. Three, two, one. Same thing as the patrol bike. So the acceleration of the Lamborghini is the same thing as patrol bike. So that's pretty. Uh, that's pretty significant. Double the price, pretty much, and it's. Same acceleration, but it's better top speed. So basically, if you want to just get away from the cops, I'd recommend the patrol bike. But if you want to like do a long range, like chase, pursuit, I'd definitely recommend the uh, Lamborghini. And of course, I'd recommend this car for everything. Is the Roadster? Would you expect? Short range speed test Roadster. Three, two, one. Six seconds. The roaster took six seconds, while the challenger took eight seconds, and the other one took uh, seven seconds, and the Lamborghini took like six or seven seconds. So let's actually do the long range, the medium range speed test with the roadster, just to see with the medium range. I will do long range probably on a on a speed test video where it's all. Speed test. We're only doing speed tests on that video. So three, two, one. So about eleven seconds. I count an extra second after we hit the pole. That pole always gets me. I count an extra second after we hit the pole. 
Those were 11 seconds, and the others were between 19 seconds to 17 seconds. So it's pretty big difference. Uh, of course, this is a uh, way more expensive, six times more expensive than the Lamborghini, which is $100,000. So this is a $600,000 car. Of course, bruh, bruh moment. So guys, that is going to be it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. Have an amazing day. And like I said, like, subscribe, hit that notification bell so I can get notified when you do subscribe. And I get your YouTube username so I can try you out in my next video. And I am going to make a video about you uh, with your username as the video title. Uh, and we probably might play Roblox or something. So comment down below. I subscribe. I'm 25th subscriber. And I hit the notification bell. And I will uh, probably chat with you on the comments. And I'll, and I'll friend you on Roblox and we'll probably play. Or something like that. Or we could do something else. I don't know. Whatever you whatever you want to do, man. Whatever you want to do. Comment down below what you want to do. Do you want me to friend you and we can just play? Or what do you want to do? Okay, dude. So if you... If you are watching this, I'll make a whole video that we got 25 subscribers. That's a much larger video, like I said at the beginning. And like I, like I've been saying recently, peace.